I've been doing it more or less all my life. I can't imagine anybody that feels better than I do. I mean, I'm happy, I enjoy life. With a net worth of almost $120 billion in 2024, Warren Buffett is one of the richest people on earth. And at age 93, the billionaire investor is still going strong. As the Oracle of Omaha traverses his golden years, he continues to defy the stereotypes of growing older with a vigor that belies the calendar's passing pages. How does he do it? Well, being able to afford the best healthcare on the planet surely helps, but when it comes to things like exercise and a strict diet, this billionaire breaks all the rules. In fact, his health habits, or lack thereof, might shock you. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to unlock more secrets to staying young forever. If you've never heard of Warren Buffett, you wouldn't be the first, since he tends to keep a pretty low profile for a billionaire. You're more likely to bump into him at your local McDonald's than see him splashing his cash on Instagram, but more about that later. First, let's take a quick look at how he got to where he is today. Born on August 30th, 1930 in Omaha, Nebraska, Buffett became fascinated with business from a young age after reading 1,000 Ways to Make $1,000 which he sourced from the local library when he was seven. Buffett's formative years saw him undertake several entrepreneurial endeavors. Among his earliest ventures were peddling chewing gum, selling Coca-Cola, and distributing weekly magazines door to door. He also lent a hand at his grandfather's grocery store. Even in high school, Warren hustled, earning income by delivering newspapers, selling golf balls and stamps, and detailing cars, among a myriad of other money-making schemes. After graduating from the University of Nebraska with a degree in business administration, Buffett worked for several investment firms. In 1965, he seized control of Berkshire Hathaway, a textile company on the brink of collapse, which he then transformed into his own investment vehicle. Through Berkshire, he built up a diverse investment portfolio ranging from Coca-Cola to Geico and deployed a strategy that championed long-term growth over short-term gains. Today, having built his billion-dollar empire, Warren Buffett stands as a paragon of investment wisdom, a testament to the power of patience, prudence, and a steadfast belief in fundamental value. What people do not look to Buffett for, however, is health advice. Despite doing very well for his age, the iconic CEO has admitted to having a shocking diet that you'd expect to see from a child, not a billionaire. For instance, he stops by McDonald's every morning during his five-minute commute and buys one of three breakfast meals, which he chooses according to how the stock market is performing that day. If the market is down, he'll opt for two sausage patties. If it's okay, he'll buy a sausage McMuffin with egg and cheese. And if the market is strong, Buffett will splash out on a bacon, egg and cheese biscuit, which in 2021 costs $3.17. Having had a lifelong association with Coca-Cola, it only makes sense that Buffett washes his meals down with a sugary beverage. In 2016, he told CNBC that he drinks probably five 12-ounce Cokes per day, which is about 700 calories, and revealed he's been doing it more or less his entire life. I mean, it's hard to argue against it when he's lived to the age of 93, but it isn't recommended for everyone. Buffett loves Coca-Cola so much that he became the face of Cherry Coke in China without even being paid for it. The billionaire's calorific diet isn't restricted to McDonald's and Coke, though. As the owner of Dairy Queen, he eats plenty of that too. When he does eat at home, some of his favorite meals include chicken parmesan and country fried steak with mashed potatoes smothered in gravy plus extra salt. Oh yeah, Buffett is a big fan of salt as well as sugar. When one journalist tried to copy Buffett's diet for a week, he said he felt bloated every day and started to get knee sweats. As part of the experience, he visited Warren Buffett's favorite steakhouse in New York City, Smith & Walensky, to order the same 32-ounce Colorado ribeye that Buffett orders. Afterwards, the journalist felt food drunk and wanted to eat nothing but vegetables for the next two days. How does Buffett defend his unhealthy habits? He argues it's a question of how much you put in and what your metabolism is, going on to say that if you eat 3,500 calories and burn off only 2,700, you're going to get fat. By that logic, you'd assume that Buffett must do plenty of exercise to burn off all those extra calories. Yet bizarrely, he doesn't. The billionaire is not known for sticking to any kind of strict exercise regimen, although he has mentioned in interviews that he tries to get a decent amount of walking in each day, often clocking a mile or two. The main thing is that he's happy and enjoys life. 
Buffett emphasizes the importance of maintaining good mental health. He spends a considerable amount of time reading and thinking, often dedicating several hours a day to reading books and newspapers to stay informed and expand his knowledge. He's also known for his optimistic outlook on life and investing. He tries to avoid stress and has mentioned that he doesn't let market fluctuations or economic downturns affect his overall mood or perspective. Perhaps sleep is the answer to his longevity, since the billionaire makes sure to get a sufficient amount each night. He's mentioned that he aims for around 8 hours of sleep per night, emphasizing the importance of rest for good health and decision making. In one interview, he said he wonders if he had a twin who grew up eating broccoli, asparagus and brussels sprouts, while he continued to drink coke and eat potato chips and cookies, who would last longer? Buffett thinks he would, but what do you think? Despite his impressive age, the native of Nebraska has not always been in good health. In 2012, he was diagnosed with stage 1 prostate cancer during a routine test. He would undergo 44 days of radiation treatment before being given the all clear, announcing to his shareholders that he felt great, as if I were in my normal, excellent health and my energy level is 100%. Thankfully, that appears to be true, as at 93 years of age, Warren Buffett just keeps going. His health habits might seem unusual compared to what many health experts recommend, especially regarding his diet. However, his focus on simplicity, consistency, and balance in his routines seems to have served him well over the years, contributing to his overall well-being and vitality. Are you shocked by Warren Buffett's health in light of his poor diet? Let us know what shocks you the most in the comments. Remember to leave a like if you enjoyed the video and subscribe for more.